What's up guys? I got a new lightsaber and this lightsaber is from Amazon. I ordered it from Amazon and it's called the Homsky or Homsky. I think Homsky sounds funnier. Um, but as of the recording of this video right now, this lightsaber is $45 and it's a NeoPixel and apparently needed to come in this really big box. All right, here's the box that it comes in. It just says lightsaber on it. This is a $45 lightsaber, uh, like I just said. I don't know much about it, but that's what we're gonna take a look at. Comes with a USB-C charging cable. Um, I see three set screws in there and an Allen key. Quite a big instruction manual. Oh, because it's in different languages, okay. And here's the lightsaber itself. And this is what I was curious about, okay? So this is a $45 lightsaber. It's a NeoPixel, meaning the blade has LEDs in it, but this one is detachable. Hopefully you guys can see that. As you can see this, there's two set screws right here. In the pictures, it looked detachable. And I didn't know if that was because it was showing pictures of the base blade was detachable, but this is a NeoPixel and this is detachable. That's interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna go get this charged up right now and then we'll have more of a look at it. Jumping over here real quick, since we are shopping around for lightsabers, I recommend you stop by and check out Endsabers. They have a lot of very nice, high quality lightsabers, some from your favorite characters and they've been so good to me they gave me a seven percent off your entire order discount code so if you use code haleon at checkout you can save yourself seven percent off your entire order okay back to the video all right now that this has had time to charge uh, let's take more of a look at it as you can see the charging port is right here while i was charging i had some time to go through the manual and it's pretty simple and i'll just show you guys that anyway so uh, to turn it on, you hold it down for, I forgot how many seconds. There, now it's in standby mode when that blue light is on. And then to turn it on... Oh, it's pretty quiet, actually. But wow, okay. You probably can't see it very well. Let me turn this light off. Okay. Single press the button to make the blade flicker and produce a sound effect. Okay, so... Double press the button to switch between different sound effects and light effects. Oh, there it goes. Oh, you can hear Darth Vader's breathing. Oh, here's rainbow mode. Hopefully that's showing up on camera. Do I need to turn off more lights? Oh, I don't have my phone with me. How's this? A little better, right? And for sound font, it says it comes with 11 to 26 sets, which I'm not sure what they mean by that, but we'll go through some of them. Oh, that was a pod racer sound. But I think this is Kylo Ren. Oh, the flash and uh, clash is pretty responsive, I think. Maybe not. And it doesn't seem to have smooth swing, but this is a $45 NeoPixel lightsaber. Wow, I'm actually really impressed for this being $45. Ray Skywalker, huh? You see that it's like kind of red and then it goes out into orange? Or yeah, red, orange, yellow, and then almost green. Here, I'm gonna try to turn off more lights. Hopefully this doesn't bother you guys that the video's all dark. Oh, 
that might be copyright music. <laughs> I think we're back to like rainbow with Kylo Ren sound font, and then it's uh, four seconds to power it down. Oh, that's mute. Um, when it's on like this, press it three times to mute it, and then three to unmute it. One, two, three. There it goes. One, two, to uh, change the font. This one's a dark saber. You can hear it. All right, I'm really curious about what's in this blade. Because there's set screws here and I really want to know what this is all about. I don't imagine it's like a NeoPixel blade like from my end saber lightsabers, but I don't know. No, I think it's a connection because um, the other NeoPixel blade would have disconnected by now. Oh, hopefully I don't break it. Okay. Oh, cool. All right. So I had a comment about this in one of my other videos about pixel blade going to this kind of connector versus like the contact uh, blade. Here, I'll, I'll just actually go get it. Well, this is my Mandalorian themed lightsaber from End Sabers. And this blade is different. You see? I'll tell you this straight away, the End Sabers is significantly and noticeably higher quality. The build is just way more solid, but the home ski for $45 is very, very solid, if that makes any sense. But no, I think this is the the new, new best budget lightsaber, honestly. Like, I'm not just saying that. This is $45, and it's a NeoPixel. Are you gonna do what I think you're gonna do? I mean, yeah, I was thinking about it. You just got that. I know. Hey, it's your money. <laughs> okay, fine, I won't. Like I wasn't gonna come out here. All right, let's start with end saber, red. Home ski is blue. So let's just start with a NeoPixel versus NeoPixel test, okay? And I honestly feel really bad about this because this home ski or home sky or whatever is a really nice lightsaber. So I really do feel bad about this, but here we go. So $45 versus end sabers. And the speaker, I didn't say this earlier, but the speaker is on the bottom of this hilt, so. I can honestly feel like it's not getting loose. It, it feels like it's slipping though, but it's not. Real quick, here's the size difference. You guys wanted to see the size difference. For this test, you guys already know, I feel really bad about this because this is a really nice lightsaber and I would recommend getting this if you're looking at getting into lightsabers, $45. And I would say I would recommend dueling with these versus even another a NeoPixel, but I do not recommend what I'm about to do. So I'm gonna take this home ski lightsaber, hit it as hard as I can on this metal pole, okay? I really don't want to, but I'm going to. <laughs> <laughs> There's people over there outside. All right, here it goes. Wow. There's a car coming. Okay, they live over there, I guess. Do it one more time before they get out there. Oh no, they're going in the garage. Okay. Just one more hit. It like hurts my hand to do this. I don't know how many more times you guys want me to do this. This is 
so far the best lightsaber that's hit this pole. The Hossett one broke off after what, one or two swings? Maybe one. We'll try this, um, this, uh, this Neopixel on this basketball pole. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try, okay? You guys can see that. But this was two. Let's go for three then, just to be sure, okay? The shock of that. And you guys probably can't hear it, but I can hear that sound echo all the way down that way. And it's probably going that way too, but. Oh, wait. Something did break, look. Yep. I broke something here, I lost some sort of connection here. So, what was that, hit number four? Let's see what happens if I hit it really hard at fifth time. And this is literally, like, actually hurting my hand to do this, the shock of this. I was gonna bring gloves, but I forgot like when I was already on the way here. Oh, weird, okay. Ah, oh, man. All right, what was that, four or five? But I have an idea actually, since I pretty much broke this one, I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna try to put the Hossett blade on this since it looked like the same connector. So I'll take you guys along for that too, but. Oh, man. All right, we'll do one more. This is either five or six and my hand actually hurts. Oh, that shock. All right, let's get back to my apartment. All right, let's check this out. Yeah, that really hurt my hand. This is the damaged part of the blade right here. And this is my Hossett lightsaber, the one that I have videos on on my channel. The blade is longer. My suspicion is that this is the same blade on the Hossett as what's in the Homeski. Hopefully the diameters are the same. So here's the connector. This is the one for the Hossett lightsaber. Here's the Hossett lightsaber blade, which I believe is just like the home ski. Oh no, maybe it's not the same. I mean, there's gotta be a way to get to it, right? They assembled it somehow. Wow, that is a really long set screw. What is this? Oh wow, okay. Oh, interesting, look at that. So this whole like core like slides out. Wow, that's interesting. So this is all it is. Because I know this is the speaker right here and this is the battery and this was located at the bottom. So if I unscrew this, this will be empty now. Yeah, see? Oh man, yeah, I can't even get to um, this connector here because you can see they, they glued it. This is completely glued. That sucks, this is a really good hilt. Maybe I can try to find a blade for it. So yeah, this is a lightsaber. This is it, the whole entire lightsaber. <laughs> this is cool though, right guys? I'm gonna definitely try and find a replacement blade for this, because this is a really cool lightsaber. All right, let me know if you guys have any other questions in the comments section down below, or if there's just anything that you guys want to talk about, just let me know, okay? I'll see you soon.